What's up everyone, Bo here from Easy App, and what are we doing today? That's right, it's another test, test your, your spot. The crowd spot. is going wild. So much fun, everyone loves this new series. Today we are going to the next location after Mudwater River to catch another unique fish. But the thing is, the thing is, there's actually two unique fish at, uh, at Rocky Lake in Colorado at level 5, and we might catch either of them on the same gear. So I'm kind of curious which one will end up catching. I could essentially be like, oh, this is the Colorado Golden Trout video, and then we'll end up catching Cutthroat Trout using the same gear or vice versa. So guess what? This is gonna be the same intro for both videos. I hope you enjoy it. Of course, the only difference will be in editing. I'll either say, today we're gonna be catching the Golden Trout, and that's about it. So let's go out and try to catch that species I just mentioned. Now for today's video, chasing after the unique Colorado Golden Trout, we're gonna be watching a video by Super Dave Gaming. Now some of you may have watched his videos if you've been looking for unique stuff, because he makes quite a few of these. But uh, yeah, we're gonna try out Super Dave Gaming's uh, spot today for the unique Golden Trout and see if it works out, everyone. Let's get started. Yeah, I like his energy. Okay, so we're gonna be fishing. Okay, on the on the left side of the lake. Sounds good. We are currently using. Well, he's using the turtle spoon. Interesting. So he's using a monster fish uh, lure to catch the unique Colorado golden trout. Oh, okay. So you can also use the uh, purple narrow spoon quarter ounce one knot as well good information now he's also giving us some information regarding like a float or bottom and he's using one out spawn sacks here but he also said mayflies would work which is gonna be a lot easier for lower level players to get so we're gonna try that as well just as an alternative I think we should be able to throw it to that spot from the opposite bank too I don't know we'll find out I guess and it just looks like he's fishing during this hot time of the day or at least towards the end here I think that's all the information we need everyone let's go get a uh, give it a try so to go over quickly what we're gonna be using we got the feather light seven foot with the turtle spoon on this one but we also have the one quarter uh, quarter ounce one knot narrow spoon purple as well to give it a try and we have uh, on a bottom rod I know he used a float rod in the video but I think we should be able to catch it on a bottom rod as well we have the mayflies uh, one knot hook and uh, we're gonna toss it out there while we're trying to catch the golden trout um, with the spinner so I get or the spoon I guess narrow spoon yeah it is a spoon not a spinner anywho let's get to it everyone All right, Super Dave, we're trying your spot today. Let's go catch some Super Dave fish. We're gonna throw this one out way off into the deeps to hopefully catch catch the golden trout. Way out there, Chris Splash. And I know he, he said to get it real close to the edge. And while we're doing that, we are going to try and catch the darn unique golden trout over in this corner using the turtle spoon. Wanna ought fourth ounce every time i see rocky lake now i just think of um just think of the horror the horror story we wrote for this and i think of just the flashes of green and yellow and the blood so much blood come on we're hooked up baby we're hooked up baby i think we should have max drag the way i set it up ooh, ooh. oh my god i'm about i'm gonna have to start walking backwards if they keep doing moves like that goodness gracious it's not a golden trout judging by the look of it Judging by the look of it, what a crazy fish though. Golly, dude, seriously. My reel can't keep up. We lost it. Oh my God. <laughs> we might need a reel with a higher retrieve if they keep doing that, goodness gracious. Oh, hooked up. We are doing a little bit of a twitch there. Doing a little bit of a twitch there. I'm not sure if this is a golden trout either, to be quite honest. There is, golly, dude. I don't know. It is. These little Crucian Hunter reels are trying their darndest. They are really struggling with uh, reeling this line in quick enough. What do we have? What do we have? Trophy Rainbow Trout. 
Oh my God, I cannot tell you. I fought for like two minutes for a four pound fish. Why do you fight so much? You're only four pounds. We have a seven pound reel on here. We should have reeled you in no trouble. Goodness gracious. Gotta be joking me. This lure is the size of your body almost. Goodness gracious, what are you thinking? All right, giving the narrow spoon a try now. Still catching the darn young rainbow trout. These darn things. You know, I'm always surprised by all the people who always fish on this left side because I always cut all my uniques on the other side. But this is, you know, this is what this is about. Trial and error. I'm sure we'll end up catching them. Just need to go. I will say, this bottom rod has done absolutely nothing this entire time. So maybe we should have done a float rod. Well, we got some small towards the end there. And it's also not a golden trout. It's a white bass. You've got to be joking me. All right, we're going back to the turtle spoon. Narrow spoon didn't do much for us. Ooh, fairly big fish came along there. Okay, watching you, watching you. Absolutely just took it and then pulled us out like 10 yards. It is looking rather silvery though. I don't know if it's a golden trout either. That'll be our first cutthroat though. Yeah, trophy cutthroat. Okay, yeah, we're getting somewhere. Another decent sized fish. Come on, be a big golden. You are not. Rainbow, little rainbow. Hooked up on something, but also looks very silver. Honestly, looks like a really nice sized cutthroat. Ah! <laughs> I knew this would happen. <laughs> well, Super Dave. Your, your way to catch golden trout also works for cutthroat, so fantastic. But north wind, we're, we still gotta try north wind's thing at some point. <laughs> God dang it! Well, hopefully he's out of the way now and we can just focus on the golden trout. So good deal, unique cutty out of the way. Ooh, hooked up into something a little big here. Also looks silvery though. Dang it! My God, are you joking? We, we actually have a bite on the feeder rod. It looks very small though. <laughs> yes, indeed. Absolute monster. <laughs> well, wouldn't you know? Oh my God. Oh my God. Goodness gracious. I thought we had max drag on this thing. Did we not? Goodness gracious. The line nearly broke. Wouldn't that be something? After all this casting with the spoon, we catch a unique golden trout on a rod with mayflies that has been sitting there with no action for the longest time. Are you freaking joking me? <laughs> How does that happen? <laughs> well, I tell you what, Super Dave, can we get it? Can we get a, a a a big round of applause for Super Dave? We tested your spot and it worked, Super Dave Gaming. Fantastic, unique Colorado golden trout on a on a on a feeder rod, one on with mayflies way back there. Um, sat back there, uh, we casted it towards the very back, I mean like literally like a foot or two off the shore, um, uh, this back of rock here. You can see that, that cliff face and if you just throw it to the left of it, to about uh, 10 feet away from this, is that a log or is that another rock? I guess if you see this bush right here, cast about 10 feet to the left right along the shore. That's exactly where we got him. Fantastic! Well the unique caller out of Golden Trout everyone, uh, why not? Mayflies, thank you Super Dave for giving us that location. If you found this video helpful or if you want to give us a like for Super Dave, make sure you do that. Hit that like button. Comment down below if you have another way you like to do it or if this video was helpful in catching your own unique Colorado Golden Trout. Let me know down in the comments and give a round of applause for Super Dave down there as well. If you want to see us on live streams every Monday, Wednesday, 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Central, make sure you do so. But until the next episode, everyone, take care. And as always, Remember everyone, we're one planet, one family, game on.